the early break, how did, how did that actually come about? Yeah, there was, um, well, there was about eight up the road, really small gap, like 10 metres. Uh, I could see that they weren't really going for it, and I just went straight across with Rob Scott from uh, With, and from there, there might have been six of us to start with, and then an hour, 10 minutes in, after just hacking away, we, um, four more came across, big group of 10, and that was kind of that, that was it. And obviously, yeah, got com points every time. Middle legs. Well, they said on the commentary that that's probably yeah, what you were looking for. Yeah, well, I've I think a few, maybe my first ever prem in like 2019, I got the, uh, the com jersey at Klondike. I was like, mm -hmm. go uphill fairly well. Um, so yeah, I went for that every time. I thought, well, even if the break comes back, it often does. At least I've got something out of the day, um, which is good. And then I went for the last, the last time I got the com points. They just they one to me with one to me until I. I was on my hands and knees, um, and that just went 20 seconds, 30 seconds, a bit gone. Uh, went back to Finn's group, just tried to get as much fuel back into me as possible um, to try and yeah, set Finn up for a, for a top result because obviously we need him to get in the, to get in the jersey. Um, and I just sat on the front 15 k's, and apparently no one came around me, so I got fifth, which is I think my best result to date after a few years of not. Well, that's a great result yeah. in, a hard, uh, in a tough, hard race like that. Yeah, I'm really happy. Um, a lot of hard training has gone into kind of being up there this year. Had a lot of really consistent results. Not not quite winning at like top step, but I think we're getting there. Um, confidence is definitely building. And this isn't gonna isn't gonna hinder that. So yeah, it's been a good day. Out. Well, I'm not sure where you're from, Ted, because you're from down south, aren't you? Originally down south, lived in Newcastle for a long time. You're certainly not a red rose boy. No, no. But uh, <laughs> you are now. Oh, I am now, exactly. Um, final question: How did you actually cope with the heat? Usually I hate it, like I absolutely hate it, but we, the support team today, were just on fire, got water every lap, um, just to cool you down, ice in the bottles, started with ice down my neck. Over the head, yeah. Just all of it, like pure Tour de France stage today, just trying to stay cool. One of those days where you probably don't drink as much as what goes over your body. Oh, exactly, um, absolutely, and I think the leg, that the body could just give up long before the legs do, mm. if you're too hot, and you just overcut the mark, so just be sensible. Well, good day for the team with yeah. ladies' jerseys and your dad's jerseys. Sure. Good day. Thanks well so. done. Cheers. So, so.